Hi, this is Hussain. Today I would like to share how to set password for particular cells. For example, if let's say I only want the authorized persons allowed to change these values, so what can we do will be first go to developer tab and we click on Visual Basic. Okay, this is bonus. So we look for bonus sheet one. Okay, we double click. Okay, after that, for the object here, we select worksheet. Okay, and then for the procedure, we look for selection change. Okay, selection change means that whenever the selection of cells change from one to the other, then the code will be executed. Okay, now we will check if this cell is selected. Okay, if the cell is selected, I will first select the other cell okay any cell also can this is to prevent creating infinite looping okay after that if let's say the user selected this cell okay i will prompt out an input box and tell the user that authorization key needed okay with a title access denied okay this is to record the password that entered by the user Okay, if let's say user did not enter anything or cancel the input box, okay, so I will stop, okay, nothing will happen. If let's say it's not the case, means that the user entered something, okay, then I will check whether the user key in correct password or not. If let's say the user key in correct password, then I will pump up the other input box and tell the user to key in the new bonus rate okay so this is the title that i set okay so the value here will be written on the cell okay will be written on here so this one will be the new rate okay if let's say the password is wrong then i will prompt out a message box and tell the user access denied Okay, we start with if, then we must end with if. We start with if, must end with if. Start with if, must end with if. Okay, now let's just see the output. Before that, please remember the password is 1, 2, 3. Okay, if let's say I click on this cell, okay, then we'll prompt up this input box and tell me access deny authorization key needed. If let's say I close, okay, nothing happened. Cancel, nothing happened. Okay, if let's say I did not key anything here and press on OK, nothing happened also. Okay, if let's say I enter a wrong password, 456, then I click on OK, then Excel will tell me access denied. Okay, if let's say I enter a correct password, okay, then the Excel will tell me the O rate is 18%, which is the rate over here, and then ask me to key in the new rate. Okay, for example, if let's say I enter 16%, 16 because it's percentage, so 16 here, then I click on OK, so we'll change to 16. Okay, if let's say we want to do the same thing for this cell, okay, so what can we do will be copy and then paste. Okay, then we check, this is also column N, but row 4. So what we have to do is, we change all the 3 to 4. So this one will be 4, will be 4. And then we don't have to worry if these two variables are the same. Okay, because if let's say this style is not selected, this code won't be executed. And so for this one. Okay, now we can check and see. Okay, now I will click on this one. Okay, same thing, if let's say I key in the correct password, okay, then allow me to change, so will be maybe I change to 8. Okay, okay, this is wrong already, this should be 2. Okay, so change to 8 already. Okay, then we change to 2, investment 2. Okay, then we try one more time, select, okay, 1, 2, 3, okay, 7, okay, so change to 7. Okay, that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this. See you.